Oh my god! It's Richard! Hi Richard, I am back! You're not, you're not Richard. You're Richard! You are Richard! Hi! Hello! You know, I got a camera now. You never guess what I'm taking pictures of. I wasn't mentally prepared for that screen. But here we are. Day 9. Really? Flump flump. Hello Henry. Having a nice afternoon? Yeah. Not too bad. I could get used to it out here. That's nice. Look, That's um, nice. I called with bad news. Oh no. Two young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported. Oh. They've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in a week. Oh shoot. They were supposed to meet an aunt down in Cody. If they're the girls from last week, then you're probably the last person to have seen them. Oh my God. You should tell whoever that I'm happy to be questioned. Look, it's not going to be an issue. Uh, I mean, if, if they turn up dead, then maybe. Oh, come on. Should I just not say anything and say oh, the yes. Mm -hmm. No. I, I think it's worth mentioning something. Yep. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll keep it vague. Why? I really don't want to talk to the cops. Why? Me neither. Right, Why not? Thanks. Enjoy the sunset. That's ridiculous. Just tell them. Just tell them what you know. Oh my god. I guess cops in the US is a bit different than in Sweden, huh? Henry. Henry, wake up. Oh shoot. What is it? What? Get out of bed and pick up the radio. Why are you so calm? What do you want? Hey, you big dumb idiot. <laughs> Wait, what? Hi, Jules. Oh, you sound tired. Hmm, I am. I have goosebumps. Are you having a nice time? Hmm. Sure. Are you? Everything good there? Jules? Oh, sorry, Henry. Yeah, I'm good. Oh my god. Oh, that's good. Well, I'll let you get back to sleep then. No, talk more. Okay, Jules. Delilah seems nice. Mm-hmm, sure. Bye, baby. Oh god. Did that really happen, or...? I gave me goosebumps. Just jumping forward, huh? Okay. Is it too much of a pain in the ass to bring supplies all the way up to our towers? Well, I get my stuff hand delivered. Oh, uh, how's that work? It's the perks of a decade of service. You're out hiking in 90 degree heat and I get to do crosswords. Oh. Isn't life miserably unfair? Anyway, when you find the supply drop, remember it's not just for you, okay? Other lookouts, biologists, a few people get their food there, and I don't want to have to call in for more. There should be loads of good stuff, though. Beans, prunes, jerky. You know, my Looking sister eats forward six to it. prunes a day. Six. Oh. She's, like, really precise about it. She'd be great Why? at this job if she didn't need wheelbarrows full of marijuana to function. Hmm. It just be like that. So, like, two weeks ago, you called me in the middle of the night. <gasps> you were sleeping, I guess, and all I heard was the name Jules through the mumbles. Oh, God. I just thought it was so sweet. I wanted to wake you up, but then I thought maybe you were having a nice conversation and I'd just be spoiling it. Hmm. I hope you're doing okay, you know, when it comes to her. I shouldn't be out here. Yep. Yes, you should. No, I just ran away from my problems. Yeah, you did. No, you didn't. Yes, you did. We all fuck up. Oh, uh, look. So, a couple of months before I took this job, I... <laughs> I was with this guy, Javier. Ugh, he's incredible, caring, sexy as hell. 
he was a driller down in Casper. Sounds like an a-hole. We dated for almost five years. Oh. I was working with the Wyoming Outdoor Leadership School, and I was obsessed with it. I wanted okay. to be an instructor so badly. And I was sure I was going to marry Javier as soon as I could be bothered. Walls was also a good excuse to get out of town, drink whiskey in the mountains, cut loose. Sure. <sighs> then, um... Javier's brother got killed working in Gillette, and for some reason, I didn't come home. Javier said it was fine. He'd go to the funeral, take care of his mom, stuff like that. It'd be easier solo. Mm -hmm. When he came back, he left me. I came out here. I lied and told my sister he fucked our neighbor. Are you serious? I oh just my god. lied about it for over ten years, and, uh... For some reason, I wanted you to know. Uh, I figured you've told me so mm. much about you, so, you know, there's something about me. We both fucked up. You don't want to address that? We don't say anything? Okay. Uh, two fork, yeah. Thanks. Alright, I got everything I need out of here. Time to chow down. Just you say on the right. others? Who do you think I am? <laughs> Double check. I just wanted to see if maybe there was something better in there. Like, could you have changed them? Could you have? Oh, oh my God! Got a front row seat for what might be the biggest fire of the year. Yeah, it's really going. God. I'm gonna call it in. They'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression, but. I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer. And hmm. she doesn't have a name yet. I usually think of something funny or something practical or a little risque when coming up with them. A risque. But why don't you do the honors? Oh. Hmm. Oh my god, yes. Uh maybe we call it the flapjack fire. Can you sell that as a name? You really like that, huh? Yeah, I said I did. It's funny. Fair enough. Flapjack, flapjack fire. fire it is. They'll probably ask me if it was a camp cooking accident or something. I like it. Flapjack fire. So there's this creek down the hill, and, um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? What's that? I love to take a bottle of whatever I have on hand, plunge it deep into the water, and let it chill in there all day. Oh. And then, on nights like tonight, when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I learned that from my sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. Wow. He would like it there. I've had a bad time with tequila. No. I'm sure I would. Sounds pretty great. <laughs> it is. Are you looking at the fire? Uh, no, I'm not. You should. Let me know when you are. I was busy. With my little turtle. Oh, see, I already took a picture. Okay, I'm looking at it again. Mm -hmm. I love how they look at night. During the day, it's just smoke, but when the sun is down, you can just get lost. This is why you wanted me to come and look at it? Yeah. All right. I'm glad you're here. Sure you are. Why do you say that? Exactly. Because I do. I'm not crazy. I mean, we've had such a good time, right? Hmm. You are crazy. Yeah, I think so. I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you. Not in the same way. Getting I weird. I know you're not really available, but... I want you to know, well... Maybe it'd be nice to get together at the end of the summer. Um... For a beer, sure. Look, we don't have to plan or even talk about it. I'm I'm just having the thought. I wish I was over there. Uh. It'd be nice to be near somebody. We could talk about these radios. We could, um, you know. No. It'd be nice to be close to someone. No, no. Why don't we both just go watch this fire and try to imagine all the old dead things that's burning away. Okay, that's a pretty nice picture. 
I will not respond to your flirting lady. Uh, I have I have a wife. You're going fishing without a license? It's one fish, and I'm sick of all the stuff I got to eat. Cool. I won't tell anyone you're a poacher. That reminds me, I keep hearing reports from Fish and Game about a problem bear they're trying to keep tabs on. Can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find? Sure. There was a crew burning fire lines out to the east, and, um, you know, I think sometimes it riles up the wildlife. Sure. Uh... Uh, sure. No problem. Remember me fondly. <laughs> you are such a drama queen. Yeah, well, I've seen what they can do to a tree, and trees aren't even yep. food. Yep. Thank you, Henry. Yeah, I don't yeah, know yeah. where I'm going. Uh, put away. Thanks. Oh my god! It's Richard! Hi, Richard. I am back. You're not, you're not Richard. You're Richard! You are Richard! Hi! Hello! You know, I got a camera now. You never guess what I'm taking pictures of. Oh. oh. Really? Again? I... Guess we're doing that then. Did they just like pop back there? If I don't confiscate them on every round? Because I didn't last time, I thought they would just stay in the tower. Tower. Ugh, thank god, no p, -p, -p panties It's my biggest wee wee weakness. Hello. Good. Oh. Excuse me? What the, uh, D? I found a clipboard down here and I, uh, there's something strange going on. Hmm. At the lake? What's up? Someone has written down what we said to each other, have been saying. That doesn't make any Feelings sense. Feelings for to maybe uh, just drunk? I don't drunk. talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No way. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Something's out here. Keep Henry? it. I'm worried. You didn't find and eat any mushrooms, did you? Well, I mean, I'm getting fun, tense. But also, you know, devastating. Shut up right now, Regardless, please. Just let me know, okay, Buckaroo? I found a walkie-talkie out here too. Uh, mm. okay. It's going shit house. Well, Get it if you haven't already, and then we'll figure out whose it is. <gasps> oh God! Henry, are you there? What happened, Henry? Dude. I, holy hell! I just I got hit in the head, punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. Jesus Christ. Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with, what, transcripts of our conversations? What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone, along with a radio of theirs. Somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. I don't... My God. What the fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? Wapiti? I, 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 I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. It's where mm. you saw that damn fence. It's north of the lake. It, it looks like there should be a trail somewhere on the north shore of Jonesy Lake. Oh, am I? I'm going Sorry, the right way. I think. No, God damn it, my head. That's are scary. You, are you sure you saw what what you saw, Henry? Maybe you pissed off some more campers and they came back to sucker punch you. Are you serious? Why would I make this up? It's an insane lie at worst, and a shitty prank at best. And you've been feeling okay? I feel fine. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I believe you, but that conversation was from two weeks ago. I know they were. So 
what's to say that they don't have transcripts from three, four, or five weeks ago? Jesus. What? Friendship our, our whole summer. Lady. Someone is out here with the walkie-talkie taking notes and talking to God knows who. What do you think is going on behind that fence? Apparently a lot of following you around taking notes. Which mm. is unfucking believable Henry. Yeah, you're telling me. Alright, I'm on my way to Wapiti Meadow. I'll let you know what I find. Okay. There, there's got to be a reasonable explanation. Also, I'm gonna call around and see if anyone's had anything weird happen to them or seemed spooked. Spooked? Uh, I don't want to make this bigger than it is yet, you know? Yeah, understood. Yeah, okay. Hike safe. I think we should change frequency, I'm just saying. Got some bad news back home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say though? Budgets being what the be budgets being what they are. Did you get my note about what went down in Wop Wopity? Oh, Sher Sheriff is in the police with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there. I guess you might not. M my, I guess you must have got hung up. Amigos in Spanish and professional. In okay, well, so this is still Ron and Dave. Old sweater? Don't know. Don't know, dude. It's just getting weird. Still, I've been playing for quite some time. It's like... Not until now it got strange, really. Quackity quackity. Where are you? Zoom. Zoom with my eyeballs. Can I get past here or not really? I don't think so. Okay, so... Where are we? Oh, we're there. Oh no, I for sure did not go the right way, but we went for the... For the little... The little deposit. The yellow boxes. Oh, lag. Zoom. Think so? I guess we're going down, huh? I'm yelling, Timber! You better move. You better rabble. Tobeans! Why wouldn't you wear shorts in the summer anyway? She pointed out, out that it would be strange. I guess I don't, actually. Now that I think about it. Hmm. Oh. Okay, I'm at the fence. I don't see anyone around, but I'm not sure I can get past it. Hmm. How big is it? Big. It goes Georgia. off in both directions. Acres. Weird. What the fuck is going on out here? Whatever it is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but mm. that's only a few square feet usually. That's not what this is. <sighs> sure well, not. See what you can do to get past it. Okay. Looks like goddamn Area 51. Yeah. Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. Yeah, we'll see about that. And what are the odds they left the gate unlocked? Pretty low, I'd imagine. Hmm. Oh. Cool. Look, I'm not going to be able to get into this place. Really? Oh, shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. If you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled hmm. burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Okay. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. 
1863. Can I try? Let me in! Okay. Never mind. Okay, so where do we go now? All the way down there? Alright. What's the medicine wheel, though? There's no real caches on the way either. Though I could double check the one, the 303. I don't have it noted down anywhere which ones I took, right? No. Alright, well, let's just... Luba luba luba. Right? All the sweets in the comment are like, holy shit. No. Not the luba luba. Oh. It's always a little bit scary when the music starts. Oof. The sensitivity is still a bit too high. But that's fine. It's like snappy. Oh. A dotted shade, huh? Gotta love it. Okay. Yeah, it's funny. I tried this new microphone and uh, my husband was sitting next to me and he hey, was... I called around. Things seem normal with everyone else. Okay. Should we call the cops or the forest service and, and let them know this is going on? Um, don't you think that would sound, you know, crazy? Why? Yeah, it is crazy. We have to tell someone. Exactly. Tell them what? Henry, tell them we're being stalked and you were attacked and we don't have any proof? What? I don't know. Tell them we're being bothered or something. Henry, I really like this job, okay? And if I give off even a hint of cuckoo to my bosses, they are never going to let me come back out here. Do you understand that? What? All right. I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Okay. Keep your radio close to you. That's your freaking job. Hey, what you just said keep my radio close to me yeah before i got attacked back at the lake i saw a radio on the ground kind of like the one i use yeah and do you think that maybe someone was you know uh i don't know what yeah maybe intercepting our frequency with other radios or something henry why are you thought. sighing? I, I don't even know how you would do that. Yeah, well, you sound worried. No, I'm not. Okay, let's not spin out of control. Just keep hiking. Whatever you say, boss. She th She's being weird. It's probably the guy that disappeared with his son. Right? I don't know where we are going, so that's why we're doing it. Okay. Oh no, that one's going up. I don't want to go there. So we have to go through the cave? We're gonna go there at some point. It's gonna be open. Do you think? No, I was gonna say we tried out the microphone and uh, he could basically sit down next to me and s scream and the, the microphone didn't pick it up. Nice. So... Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't have a good feeling about like you. Feeling vulnerable. Uh, it's not like you can just call the police. I was thinking about the Goodwins. It just struck me that if anything weird like this happened to them, happened to Brian, just how scared he would have been. Mm hmm. Hmm. He had his dad to protect him. Ned, right? Yeah, yeah. Ned. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. It was, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. No, this is fishy. I think it's even war more alarming that Delilah doesn't want to... Delilah, if that's her name. Don't want to report it. Or tell someone. Or do something. Or, you know. Oh, let's not talk to the cops. Let's not... Risk losing the job? What are you talking about? 
There's some campers out here harassing us. What would be so difficult in reporting that? <gasps> oh my god, what if that's what happened to Ned? Or didn't agree very much? Yeah. Alright, then so from here... Um... Door fair gate, probably. Where would we be able to cross? There's a cache there. We could go to the medicine wheel. It's very, very, very good that I can... I have the option to add my... Pinpointer to the map where I was, because uh, I don't think I would have uh, been able to do this other way through. Just been episode after episode of WHERE IS Kelly? You know. She's lost again! How strange! Oh no, I need to take up my map. Um, basically that way? Medicine. Well, well, we'll check it out. We'll see what that darn that is about. Oh, is that where I said the Blair Witch Project? Oh, not really. Wow, there's an old um. I think it's called a medicine wheel out here. Yeah, it was made by Crow American Indians hundreds of Ooh, years ago. Oh, wow. There are lots of small ones. Um, have you ever been to Medicine Wheel Monument over in the Bighorns? Well, I sure haven't. Well, it's worth a three-hour detour on the way home in August. Mm -hmm. uh, neat. I'll keep it in mind. Why would they... What, what is that? Uh, we obviously don't have those kind of things in Sweden. Um... You know? What was it for? Oh. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks. Oh. Now there's someone in it. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. The scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it. Cool. What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Ugh, are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. Oh. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. Mm-hmm. I don't... I don't trust her. I mean... Off you go. Oh. One stray match. Protect the forest. Yeah, that's one little brave match. Copy. Thank you. Three blind rats. I don't think I need to look into all the little details of that, of those books and stuff too much. Oh, I see. Can you find another turtle? Oh, look at that. Big tree, huh? Ski? What? Hug it. There's so much forest in Sweden that one of the things that you learn is to hug a tree if you get lost. Okay, so we need to go east. That's actually a true story. Because you're less likely to be found if you're wandering around. So hug a tree and hang all your crap in it. So if you have any... 
don't know, anything colorful would do. There's been a couple of, well, I can't say often, but from time to time, you see the helicopter fly over the forest. Try to find people, though. There's some old snowmobiles out here. What? Why? That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. Uh. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Yeah, maybe just follow the tracks, though, I guess. Oh. Whoa. Someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. Huh. I and mean, that's weird, right? I mean, I can come up with a bunch of not weird reasons someone would do that out here, but given what's happened, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Hmm. I mean, they wanted the uh, engine parts. Pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah, where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but mm. um, well, folks kept stealing it. Pork Pond. Uh, because it's called Pork Pond. It's a good goddamn name. Mm -hmm. That sign would look great in a den, or you know, anywhere. Yeah, I guess so. Are you the one who stole it? Can't. Oh, I can. So, is the scout camp anywhere near Pork Pond? Yeah, it is. Just keep heading east. You'll cross a small ravine and you shouldn't be able to miss it. Okay. Oh! Oh, that is so cute! Arap, Arapaho, I don't know. Come on. Camp Arapaho. You're there? Yeah, I am. <sighs> it's been out there since the 50s. Hmm. I was never really into the idea of the scouts. It's something about men organizing boys around their ideals. Never sat right with me. Ah, yeah, that's true. Beware of weebelows in large numbers. Beware of anyone in yep. large numbers. I mean, yeah. The bridge to the camp is out. Damn. Hmm. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Alright, then we will do exactly that. And we'll do just that. I don't think I need to hold up my little compass and look all important anymore. Can I... can. Gosh. Oh. Oh. <gasps> cool. Wouldn't they put different creatures? I don't... I mean, don't quote me because I don't know because we don't have this kind of stuff in Sweden. Sweden. Yeah. Oh. You ever talked to any of the scouts? No, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Mm. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Okay. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. I mean, he, he wasn't a scout or a weevil or whatever? Mm. I got the sense that boy could barely tie his shoes, let alone a clove hitch. What the hell's a clove hitch? Ah, uh, well, it's not that you are probably too old and too stubborn to learn. Hmm. You use it to make rafts and shelters and stuff like that. Huh. You know how to tie one? Heck no, I'd make a weeblow do it. <laughs> uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblows. For the past 35 years, yeah. Hmm. So there are bear traps out here in the scout shelters. Scouts are stalwart prey. That's messed up. Ten to one. It's a lot of crime stories and stuff. Oh. Is it the same one? Yeah. Wait, what? 
Didn't the picture look different? Uh. Hmm. I thought the picture looked different on the other one. Maybe I'm just remembering it wrong. Yeah, okay. Yeah, these guys are gone. Oh. Not where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. Okay. It looks like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the back country and getting through that fence. I found a little trowel. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should take it with me. Could use it to pop open beers. Oh. Wow. Um, 99% sure that's for burying poop. Yep. And I already touched it. <laughs> hmm. Yes. Yes. Quite good quality. This is where... This is the stuff. Yes. Go with the trowel. Hmm. Huh. Hey, D, they left something behind. It's uh, like a memo from their bo boss. Did it say anything of note? Uh, next few days, dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Oh. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. <laughs> my mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. Uh. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? Fires. I mean, you and I aren't very interesting. Us. They're researching us. You... you think they're studying you and me? I do, yeah. I mean, maybe it's about studying two strangers who talk every day. Like, if you put someone in isolation with someone else, yep. what they do. Yeah, that's what I think. Well, fuck that. Agreed. I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I saw it. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so yeah. I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and... Keep an eye out for anyone following you. Alright, well, I didn't actually read it. Uh, Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Look at that leaf. Wanting to be part of everything. Go away. Um, squad... Squad boss Carson. In the next few days, you and your team will be dropping into Thorofair region of Sh Shoshone National Forest to cut a fire line south of Ruby River. I'm writing you on behalf of Dr. Ben Simmons at Wapiti Station. He reached out to the superintendent with wildfire concerns about his research site. Upon your return, someone from his office will want to speak with you as part of the wildfire risk assessment of our of the region. I told them they have nothing to worry about and that your team's fire line are the most potent preventative measure in protective, uh, protecting their site. Even though they'll be more than a mile away. But I think they've got the insurance companies to answer. They've got insurance companies to answer to. Thanks as always for your service. Well... Okay, well, I don't think there's anything else down here for us. Pork pond, lovely. Um, so we have to go all the way back. I guess so. Ah, Lord. Let's go. Why could I stomp it out? Hold on. Hold up. Okay, though. Uh, did what I had to do. Oh, this is gonna be the one with the broken... Broken... With the broken bridge, huh? No? Guess not. No.
Yeah. So how will we get back? So Darth bent, heck bent on getting here that we don't know how to get back. Oh, never mind. Cool. Can we... Yeah. Very nice. We're free. Are you there? I I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Yeah. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? No, don't tell her. Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right. So, uh, tell me what you think of this. Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? What? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Get in your tower. Shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Oh my god! Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The flapjack fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, I went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Are you kidding right now? Did you not stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Hmm? Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, yeah. You know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Mm. Great. Just Did she hide something on it? Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Yeah. Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me, just, um, hmm. internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Okay, so... Alright, so cottonwood, something. She meant in this area, okay. Uh, Thunder Canyon, Pretty Station. Hmm. I guess we could just walk outside and check the. Because there's uh, a couple of... what was that? Whoa, the flapjack fire isn't going anywhere, huh? No, flapjack that's fire. why those guys came out to burn that line. Oh. It's at that stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. They're not gonna try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. Hmm. So this is like a controlled fire, they were expecting that to burn? So if I look at these... That's Jonesy Lake. Been there a few times. That's not where we're going. I was thinking that maybe that trail down there. South from here. So that way. Let's check it out. Don't think I went on that trail actually. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, got the Cottonwood Creek. Oh, 
Oh, it's to there. Oh, I see. House blinds. It's where this huge tree was. The, um, near this pork pond or whatever. Just keep hearing stuff around all the time. It's starting to freak me out. We took that one, I think. Oh. No, we didn't. Ooh, lovely. Let's take that. Mainly to update the map, I guess. It's a good thing. Okay. Ron, really wish the power that uh, that B could issue us radios that didn't suck suck. Blah. Most of the time, I'd prefer to keep things pen to paper, but every once in a while, I'd, it'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. My sister keeps leaving me messages at the main main office, but I don't think she guessed that I took the job. Oh, so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. I've been sitting at this at the spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her. But I'm a quarter way through this bottle of some booze, I guess. Miss you. Interesting. How well did they know each other? Me. More of these? Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's a lot of books. Some toilet paper. So it was just sitting here with this floating note. Me. Yeah. That's a nice spot to just sit down, I guess. Okay. Where was it? We are... Oh. Okay, so... To the west a bit. Yeah. Let's do that. Also, I'm thinking... Could you find a second turtle? Because I would want to find a second turtle. That would be pretty cute. Oh, there's the big tree. Okay, what does she want us to find here? This does look like a hangman tree, doesn't it? Oh, no. Okay, so we're here and it's... in this creek somewhere? Do you think or do you think I missed something here? Big tree, yeah. Okay. What are we supposed to find here? Hmm. You think she left something in this uh, cache? Maybe. I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. Hmm. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's 5678. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I was in a rush. 5678. Oh, wrong way, but that's fine. We got it. Oh, no. Oh. I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Mm. Hopefully. 
hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry, we have to get into that site. What the fuck is going on? People mm. are listening to us? I don't know. Our radios are tapped? Are you fucking serious? <sighs> Our radios are definitely tapped. That's why I left you the one you just got. How, how, how is this even possible? I don't know, Henry. What do you know? Exactly, what do you know? Scared. Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Someone else in on this? Anyone? <sighs> this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Are you sure? Are you sure, yeah? Yes. I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. Mm. The fucking state coordinator asked if I was just having lady troubles. Oh. So no, this isn't happening to anyone else and I'm done asking. Mm. None of it makes any sense. Who is doing this? I don't know who could be doing this. <sighs> Henry, I've been at this job off and on for 13 years. Oh, shit. Sometimes here, sometimes over near Jackson, a couple times down in Wind River. And nothing like this has ever happened before. Hmm. Am I just making all of this up? I mean, the eavesdropping, the spying, is this... Fuck, are you... Are you is any of this real? What? Are you serious? Maybe I'm, I'm just... Maybe I'm just losing my mind. Yeah, I would think what? that too. Like Julia. And maybe it's happening to me and, and I'm imagining oh. that I have a boss out here and that we're being spied on. Henry. Maybe there was something in the water or our condo was underneath some power lines and and you, Delilah, you're not real. Oh, man. Henry, Henry think about her. If what happened to her were happening to you, you wouldn't even be able to realize it. Okay. Henry. Mm. Sweetie, I am real and this is happening. I'm as real as the sky is blue. Take a second and then call me back. I'm on your side. Mm. Technically, the sky isn't blue. Okay, I'm all right. I'm uh, I'm headed towards the site. Good. Keep your head up. Damn. Yeah, that would for sure make me question things too. But then again, I've been questioning this Delilah character the entire time. <laughs> hey. I just thought of something not, um, not great. Oh, tell me. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that Ooh, went no. missing a few weeks back. Why? What? Why would you do that? I told you to say the minimum and just keep it vague. I know. And I didn't. Ugh. I I just didn't want to be hassled. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. Yep. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Yep. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. Why did she really do that? This. Why would she do that, though? I mean... To save a face? That's ridiculous. Could have just said that they saw them. And what happened? At that point, I don't think we did anything wrong. Even if we got angry at them. Right? That's stupid. That's stupid. Alright, let's get to the fence. We have the axe, I hope. If you didn't leave it in the house. Why would it? I mean, if I went to that camping place, would I find those fireworks and stuff again? You think? I don't know. Let's see. We have to go to the fence. Oh, silly. Let's go back. Um. Yeah, I think we're gonna go through the door. So west and then north. Okay. Let's go. It's a pretty game. 
I don't know how much further we go. Oh my gosh, maybe we're the ones with memory issues. It's not Julia, it's us. That's scary. All the thoughts you start asking yourself, huh? I think I would ask similar questions too. Okay, I think we could cross over here. What? What? Why is the sun, sun green? <laughs> yep, yeah, we're going to Lulu. Alright, let's see. So we're here, yeah. Good, good, good. Ooh, that spin to get sometimes. What? What is? Who did that? The spin that you get sometimes when you rappel down a wall. I get super confused every time. Okay, here we are. Let's see, we should be able to. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Yep. Copy that. 